Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I did a video before that was really popular um, about Primark nails and I was basically, I was rating them so much and I still rate them. I just wanted to do a video about the cons that I have experience with my Primark nails <laughs> because I don't want people to look at my video and think oh my god they are the next thing it's gonna save me so much money because they're so much better than acrylics like in a way I think they are better than acrylics but I wouldn't say that they're like better quality if you know what I mean but I'll start off with the packaging I can show you here because I bought some just now for late night shopping as you can see they look really nice these ones I've got have sparkles in them and I got some Ficus, ficus, ficus. I got some a while ago that had, uh, I think, these just these two here. They had uh, glitter on them, like uh, gems. Not glitter, it's gems. And I was like, oh, that's great. And then I was like, well, I probably have more in the back. And the others were just like plain. And then, so that's obviously what you get. And I've got hair, but. Oh. You get spares in the back and you get your glue with it as well. So I had a look in the back of my other one and they had some nice plain, I think it was pink, yeah it was pink, pink nails with gold gems on it. Where's all of them gone? Oh my god they've just spilled everywhere. The only, the only nails that had gems on it was in the front of the package and that packaging and that was only two of them and then the rest of the nails in the back didn't have any gems in it at all, it was just all the like normal ones. So that means it didn't have any spare gem ones, which was really annoying. Obviously, like you get what you pay for. It was only three pounds for the ones with the gems on it. And the the plain ones are only oh these are two pounds because they've got glitter, glitter in it, glitter in me. Um but these oh these are nude sparkle, just in case anyone wants to know. So moving on to the next con that I experienced. When you take your nails off you're supposed to soak them in acetone. Obviously I have no patience and I wasn't doing that but I have actually I bought some today. This is artificial nail remover concentrated formula uh, effectively removes all types of artificial nails and I got that from Superdrug. That was only £2.70 I think. I wasn't using this stuff in the first but in the first few weeks and I was just ripping them off, putting on new ones, ripping them off, filing my nail down, putting a new one on even though when you rip them off your nail, some of your nail comes off like this. I took this off because it was falling off. It goes, god damn it! Don't know if you can see that but like some of the nail up here is a bit gross and this nail's gross but it's been on for a while so ignore so obviously like a little bit of your nail coming off like you wouldn't bat an eyelid it's going to grow out and just trim it down when it grows and then we'll put some new nails on this happened to me yes i got nail fungus because my nail was that damaged it started growing fungus from this nail um it was a while ago, it's not there anymore as you can see. My nail actually did get nail fungus and it was frightening because I was bowling and my nail just flinged off when I bowled and uh, I just saw green all over my thumb and I was like, oh. but I didn't worry about it for a while. I looked it up because I'd, I've never had nail fungus before and it said just keep it clean otherwise it will spread throughout your whole nail and you have to have it removed or it will just fall off and then you'll get like blood infections because like it's in your nail and so shit like I've damaged my nail proper but it just went away it, it was fine in the end it just it kind of grew out as well it grew out with the nail and I kept trimming it and then it eventually left it left my life completely it was fine this is the last one uh, there's only three cons I can really think of this is one's quite a funny one actually <laughs> so I was pulling up my jeans because they're skinny jeans I need a bit of a a bit of a I looked at my nails, I didn't feel it happening, but that happened. <laughs> I just looked at my nail and it was just bent like that, but I ended up just bending it back up again. It does leave white marks on the side, as you can see. I mean, I'm going to change them in a minute anyway, because... They're, I've had them on for like a week and they're a bit rank so and like half of them are like falling off but yeah obviously I said they last like two weeks tops they don't always last two weeks just remember that they probably some of them might fall off because you, you're quite handy with things like you use your hands for a lot of things so they might fall off <laughs> they're not acrylics <laughs> but anyway I hope that you enjoyed this video please like subscribe and comment and I hope to see you guys soon bye